let's load up our game. We actually had uh, quite a bit of people here last week. Uh, so let's see if there's any people around today. Uh, we're in month four, day 19. That is actually longer. If you look at my other saves, the poisonous bandits here were four months and three days. And before that, four months, day seven. Ooh, this one we went five months with. D I've, I've done a few playthroughs, by the way. But yeah. Uh, so this might be our longest uh, playthrough yet. I'm kind of planning to get through all of the content. Just clear out everything in this one. We'll see. Let's load up. Mm. The only place we've cleared out is... Gusenberg and we're working on Arthas. I think we're gonna be able to finish Arthas today And then we'll see about uh, Like where do we want to go next? If you have thoughts, please uh, share them Secret funding, I don't understand why this is not completed. I Think that's a mistake because I've actually cleared this out uh, we're gonna go down here, deliver this quest. Uh, buried memories, we'll have to do that. We'll have to do the bandit encampment. This one. Mm, and that's about it, I think. Yeah. We just want to check marks. Let's run this way. We have been here before. I think, yeah, this one. We're going for this place right now. Let's pick up some stuff, though, while we're running around. I've yet to go up here as well. I know what's there, but, you know. Hmm. And other than that, we're kind of just killing everything. Talk to this guy. Okay, he's got a bunch of people down in the cellar. I get a crude key. I'm going to convince the man to let me kill the plague-ridden people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's afraid because they have people in the cellar. Hey, guys. Let's fight them. Bunch of plague ridden. And we're gonna start off with um, something I would consider an easier fight. There's three plague ridden. Right. Really? Okay. So this isn't even exciting. Um. Where's my dude with? Yeah, we can do... We can do this guy, right? I'll just get some points. Stab this guy. Poison, yeah. Damage is not a problem. Where's my archer? Archer's over here. Oh, that's kind of unfortunate. <laughs> 58, okay, let's see what you do. That's it for you. You can reach, uh, you can actually charge this guy. Kill this one. How exciting! Difficult battle battles from the start here. Hmm. Cool. We talk to her. We get some wine. Awesome. Oh, what? 
Look at that. There's fresh mint there. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's go pick some mushrooms and we'll we'll go do some fishing at the shoreline here as well. Cause we do love our fishing game, right? That is quite an important part of this game. He's experienced. I think he can get better than experienced though. Cheers. I mean, this is this is food at least. So this will make us not have to fight boars or wolves. Like if we want to not spend the money, and I kind of don't want to spend money on food. It just takes time gathering food by fishing or by um, fighting animals. Now, you could always make the argument that you're going to use a lot of fatigue fighting boars and wolves so you could go and make money during that time to buy stuff instead hmm. but i don't know i mean if you i don't know how much fatigue you get in one battle i think we got quite a bit just from the plague ridden there a brain my good sir, welcome in, dude. Hope you're doing well. Just chill chillin' with some more tales today. Um, I kind of want to clear everything for once. Uh, but honestly, clearing everything at this point of the game... Uh, it kind of feels like a chore, you know? I'll be completely honest. We have all of the skills we want. We have, well, okay, there's a bunch of new cool skills I could get at level 10. The problem is I don't actually have new enemies to use them at. I just have the same enemies that I kind of slaughter whenever I face. Uh, okay, so it's the buried memories. We need to go there. We can pick up some wood over here. Now, I don't mind fighting the same guys that much. Uh, my main problem with this is that... I just demolish everything I fight. So it isn't really exciting. We're going to kill this guy, I think. These guys. Let's do a proper fight against some bandits. Level 9. Ooh. It's so much fun when you're looking for equipment and stuff. Uh, when we're past that, not that interesting. No, we have two archers over here. Okay. We're going to ignore those archers. There's no archers over here. If I start here, it's going to take these guys a couple of... There's three archers here, actually. Hmm. So this guy's dangerous. This guy's pretty dangerous. Hmm. I could slow... If I could slow these two down, it would be kind of good. I could use a Spearman for some of these people. Let's see. So my plan is to... Charge through these guys and move away. Uh, I think that means Archer over here. We'll do spare guy over here as well. Mm, tater, you can stand here. Viking brain space. Actually, if I have all of my engage 
dudes over there, I should have a Rexus behind so he can do the smoke screen. And Titan can chill out here. Okay. So we have parts of a plan. Let's see how it goes. Engage. Charge through these guys. Slows them down. How far does he go? Uh, oh, he's going to reach me over here. And there. I think... Yeah. I think we're taking care of these four guys. They're not no danger anymore. And then we'll do like inspiration to just charge into these archer at some archers at some point. Okay. Hmm. If I go in, he moves 10. He got like 12 movement. I think he should be safe over here. <laughs> Let's see, Brain. I think we got you. Aren't you my... Uh... Yeah, you're over here. It's still the same playthrough. F is Brain. You're my... Oh, you got the cool uh, one-handed mace, actually. <laughs> We're trying to actually kill everything in this one. Yeah, let's put up the spare wall and hopefully these guys will both run into that. I think he's gonna go here. Hell yeah. That means we have everyone under control. He's gonna go... You know what? This is gonna work perfectly. He's gonna go over here. Then it's time to start engaging people, I think. Um, I'll do protection, that's fine. He can't reach me, we engage, we get Valor points. These guys will reach me if I go forward. Um, Seven point five. That leaves me enough to go back. Ah, they would have died by extra damage he does. That's nice. Good job. Hmm. Oh, these guys move at the very end. I mean, this guy will... I could kill him. He's moving next to this guy, okay. Okay, Brain can go over and help here. Attack until fever is applied. Once. Twice. Fever, damn it. Hey, we are best friends, Brain. Just happened. Um, 11.5, you can move back. Oh, 
crit there. That's nice. Let's get some points. Let's disengage here. And we just go chill out in the back. Cool. Oh, damn it. He didn't go into the zone. <sighs> I'll do this. Inspiration for everyone. Ah, I can't pull him that far. Um, yeah, let's burn him. What kind of deep... What kind of items do, does he have? Yeah, he's gonna start burning. Did I get the crit? No, I start burning if he ends his turn next to me, right? Anyone? What's his health? 44. Space here is very strong. Poacher, wrongdoer over there. Okay. I'll move here. Really? Did he do? He did minimum damage. That means we have damage reduction on the next attack. Annoying. This more other, right? Um, hmm. Okay, we'll go in here. There we go. Critical, nice. Uh, archers aren't gonna be a problem just yet. Let's go here. We'll have to go and uh, engage these guys later on. Uh, he's moving next. I don't think I'll kill him. Or I will. Oh, he's round and everything. Okay, cool. Good job. I have the point, so I think... We'll move up. We'll disengage this guy. Or disarm him. And engage with the torch. I might have forgotten to put in shields on my people. These guys aren't going to be able to attack. Casual. Sadly, these guys have a lot of defense. Um, it's easy for me to avoid them. I can just charge them. Okay. What? Is this double movement? Crap. That's unfortunate. Because we're just standing there then. Let's burn them. engage him oh shit yeah my guys are really starting to do damage what kind of mace is this he only has 38 strength like next phase is gonna be 
a beast when I get my uh, new mace. I start burning, that's unfortunate. Looks like these guys are going real late. And, uh... Attack. And attack. Hmm. So I want to heal space. That's brain. Brain can do that. Rid of the burn. Stand over here. Uh, okay, okay, Castle can actually go. We can, uh, disarm him. We're just trying not to get attacked at all. That's kind of my goal here. Archers have moved now. It's only these two guys left. Titan cannot sadly not attack here. Um, do I disengage him? I really don't need to. Well, someone can engage him again. Let's do it. Now he starts burning. Sad. Uh, let's do that again. The poacher will move. So I'm gonna need to move my guys up now. We're taking on all of the archers. He can deal with him though. What's his health? One, maybe. Yeah, he's dead. We charge these two. Get over here. Who's next? Uh, he is. Okay. Move twenty-four. Let's go here. I'm gonna take burning damage. Oh, I would. It, it's almost perfect, right? It's this close to being the perfect fight. Well. I can heal casual. I'm using all my Valor points, though. <laughs> Just, it's so nice if I can go through the whole thing without... Boom! Without taking any hits. Well, that was effective. Look at that. 
No. No. Ah. Damn it. Still annoying. Still extremely annoying. Uh, I am not gonna be able to kill. Oh, might be able to kill him. Oh no, he's a ban. Uh, where's my swordsman? There we go. Look at this. Shit. I'll kill the last dude as well. Health damage doesn't really matter. Unless you lose 50% of your health, then you get an injury, right? Shit. I have so many torches, I can just use them. Cheers! We won! <sighs> One armor. Okay, we need to camp. Let's do that. And then we're gonna do the last quest, uh, like main quest in the Fate of Arthas. And it's just like gathering up a few pieces here and there. Um, and we'll be done in this zone as well. Um, do I cook something? I don't think I can use carp in anything else. We don't have that much salt actually. Okay. We'll do this one. We'll do mead pike run speed, sure. Strength increased. Cool. Mead out. I have alcohol. Yeah, mead pike. And shrooms. I'll eat a carcass. I'll increase the volume. Cool. How are we doing here? Two out of seven. Until we're until next phase is gonna be like six dude. Oh oh time. I don't think I've done the Come on. This is the Oh no. Yeah, it goes away at six hours. Shit. Okay, we gotta wait until night so we can do the Phantom Swarm. Phantom Swarm? I'm uh, looking kind of forward to that. It's probably boars here or something. No, a few bandits. They're very uh, close to his castle. No need to fight them though. Okay, let's uh, head into Lord Vernalis's castle. Apothecary. Hmm. Every time a skill deals damage, 30% chance to increase dexterity. That's by 10%, I think. That's fine. Oh, infectious oil. Status effects. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, what can I craft? Need brandy for this. Oh, I need some alisarian powder. Throwing knives. Petrifying throwing sickle. Oh, you can do confused. Okay. Cannot receive bonuses. That's not really great. 
protective oil. Hmm. I have no medicine. Let's get some medicine. Also, we don't have a lot of wiles, so I might as well buy some. I'm also missing fish oil, and that's an offer. Let's buy 20 of that, and let's buy five of these five. <sighs> Lord Venalis. Hey, buddies. Lieutenant Arsika. Aceresia. Lieutenant Aceresia. Lord Venalis. Okay, we're gonna go and attack Count Lahart's castle. The black caravans? Hmm. Now, what we want to do is go get the Phantom Swarm first. Because I think on this side, I forgot to stop by this place. But I need to do the Phantom swarm, swarm, that's over here, and this one, and we're done on this side of Arthas. And then it's just, yeah, that's going to be finished as well. So we need the bandit encampment. I'm not wanted, no. I don't remember what's the deal here. Oh, I need an ornate key. Right. Guess I'm not gonna finish this right now. T doesn't seem to go down. What? Are you shitting me? Yeah, we got the ghost pack. <laughs> Maybe I have to fight the boars tomorrow morning then. All right, where do we start? Feels like the middle here. This place is great to defend against the Phantom Swarm. Mm, only problem is I probably need to run through here with a couple of guys. Don't want to start on these two places. I could start on these two places. Hmm... Yeah, he's fine to run through here. He would also be able to get away. Abrexus needs to be kind of defended. Hmm. It would be better to run through with him. I could slow down two guys. Put our spare guy here. I'm just gonna start over there. Yeah. I'll burn him. There's 18 enemies from the start here. Hmm. Go over here. Now, I don't know where this one is. I'm thinking he might come over here. No. Next up, it's... Like, these guys won't reach me. He will. Hmm. 
Mm. I'll go here. Let's go. Who moves next? This one. Cool. Eleven. Okay, they're coming from over there. This guy's moving forward. Mm, this one next, okay. We'll do a soul in here. I am going to take damage in this fight. Who do we go with next? So he's going to move in. I think we just fight this one. Oh, I'm gonna kill this one, right? But we got deflection from that. Maybe he dies. I was a bit hopeful. Eight damage, that's fine. Who's next? Not this one, still. Um... fun and then we just <laughs> what is this challenging shout not really cool yeah I'm struggling to see I honestly I don't enjoy this because there's no danger whatsoever here now I think we might actually change over uh to like one hour 20 here and do soul stone survivors instead because i'm thinking i think that's a lot of fun this feels more like a chore i have wanted to kind of clear out everything but they just they need to ramp up the difficulty honestly it's just it's not hard anymore Oh, he did fever immediately? Damn it. Let's kill it. Because we're not gonna face anything that's kind of harder than this. This is as hard as it gets. <laughs> I actually think these fights might be the hardest thing in... Well, okay, some of the champions and stuff, you need to be at least a little bit tactical. Um, but like, we're looking at getting better weapons for people right now. And my enemies aren't going to get any new skills. They're not going to be stronger in any way. Sad though. Oh! Looks like none of these are gonna be able to come forward though. This one's gonna run into the spare wall. Cool.
22 enemies. But they're just gonna run in the way of each other. Like, this was kind of lucky setup. And look at him. <laughs> look at that. He's got 60% more damage now. It just keeps stacking. Mm. I could go here, or I could go... Let's do this. That one's gonna get killed. Oh, he didn't die. Damn. Cheers. Stand there. He's gonna might might kill something coming for him. That one's dead. This one's not. Uh, that one might die. I'm not completely certain. Mm, let's go here. Can he get past now? I think he can. shotting these now okay this one's not gonna reach me nice next face can go and fight a little bit like I don't even need to go defensive here I can just go offensive against these dudes <laughs> to kill things. Hand-to-hand -hand combat isn't going to be good here. Look at my valor points. Okay, we took a Okay. Stab this one. Do you smoke screen? Should have engaged this one as well. Where's this boar? Oh. This ghost wolf? That's gonna reach me. Mm. I mean, it's fun to use challenge shout. I think this might be one of the first times I use it. Let's burn him. Kill? Hell yeah. This one did move. Um, I 
Oh, he has rivalry. What is that? Rivalry as long as there's no other unit next to them or their op op opponent. It's pretty good. 50% damage reduction. What? Fever on the first hit? Damn. Now let's see where the uh, big bad boys come. Oh. Um, so, there's the Nightmare, okay. Forty-eight, I do forty-seven, really? Probably a kill. Good. The wolves will just die from this, right? And his damage increases! <laughs> He's a double damage now. <laughs> and he does he has a shit bow, right? He has a hunter's bow. Mm. That one might not die. Oh. Can't see the enemy. Okay. Let's just go here. Forgot about that. Ah. <sighs> Let's see who can kill people here. I think we want to do ovation here. The only thing I'm forgetting, I have a spearman over here. He needs to hold these guys off. Uh, short. Then critical on him. Cool. Look at that. Fifty-one. Not necessarily a kill. Let's kill it. Good job. Should we go for this one now? Kill the weak. Come on. Hey, good job. Uh, you can just stand there. Give him brutality. Eight left. Where's my enemies? One, two, three, four, five, six. Might be more over here. Who could reach him? Oh, right. This is with fragility, so I'll take that. I get terror every time I attack him. He might actually run off in them here. Boris dying one shot now. <laughs> yeah, let's get you over here. Doesn't do that much damage. But I think with my uh, with uh, Abrexus, we're gonna finish him off. 
cast it. Is he running into the spare? No. Yeah, I think this is the quickest I've ever killed these guys. This boar, uh, yeah. One down. Is anyone? Oh, you have double movement, actually. Oh, so he's just gonna finish these guys off. They're dead. guys just chill oh we have four guys left one two i don't know where oh that's over here and we have a boar okay Does this move? Spare wolf. Rain can help. I'll kill the last one. Cheers. Okay, we got a lot of meat and stuff. Oh, they died as well. Cool. The hunt is done. That's good. carcass we'll pay taxes uh oh we need to drink something a wine Ooh, rain what do you want to say something you ate i'll use some medicine for that uh okay oh we actually have too much stuff I mean, it's not to wear. We have 35 of these. Um, okay, we can just like ditch two of them and we're good. So, yeah. We are ending things. <laughs> I mean, there might be some new content I haven't seen yet, but I'm going to be fine just, like, pushing that until later. I don't know why I'm doing this last thing. What? You know what? We're going to do a puzzle. That's going to be one of the last things we do here. Because, at, like, at this point... We're just doing like numerous fights. We have to fight a lot to kind of finish things. Yeah, I'll... The puzzle is now complete, yes. Um, okay. And we can get the top immediately here. Um, mm -hmm. That 
That's good. So these are in order. That one com comes there. Let's go... I think we're gonna get it. Very soon here. I know, it's exciting, right? Had to think a little bit uh yeah and we got the inquisition rendezvous point cool okay so unfortunately for anyone joining in for war tales today uh i think we're just gonna call it on this run because at the moment we're killing everything, right? Goes great. Our tactic here was um, to go for a barrage archer, push in a, bun a couple of guys who can uh, engage, like casual engages, brain engages, space engages. Then we have a Brexus with the smoke screen, and Gecko with the barrage for uh, most of the damage here. Uh, now, you can see, for example, this guy is level 8. <laughs> We're killing everything as it is. At level 10, which is kind of far away, I would get the indomitable one. Which would give me 77 strength versus... <laughs> versus 15. Strength really... Yeah, goes through the roof with the higher levels. But still, 77 in two levels... He would just he would destroy everything also the skill from this bow is just insane we're kind of unlucky though this was the first uh, epic weapon i got i went for this to make gecko do more damage at level like four or five i killed the dude with this one and then it came out with required level 10. uh the problem was I was getting attacked too much, so we did add in an extra hair to get the slowdown. He's been very important. He can also engage, and uh, I can take advantage of smoke screen here. But the slowdown on like this is usually he does uh, gives someone fragility, does the da damage on a couple of people, and slows two guys down so they won't be able to attack me fantastic movement was kind of a problem because i'm going with like heavy armor on casual medium armor so we brought in an axe dude also we got this axe uh and threw in the inspiration which deals with all of my movement troubles right Still, with these seven guys, we were struggling with the lead, so we had to cheat and put in someone with spare wall. Kill the weak. This is a new weapon. Really like this one. I think it's a good one. If he's engaged, you get to use it twice, I believe, because it resets the skill. If the unit, meaning Professor J, was already engaged. Uh, he's... A spare wall guy though so i don't think i don't think he's been engaged ever except when he attacks with this and then he just immediately disengages again mm, i like the spare new spare cool also this axe is new i think that's cool burning so burning is uh good i would say run around with this on the torch right I think someone else mentioned that like you should give him a torch and i was like yeah i'm an idiot of course he should have a torch then he will always crit here's the other thing he's level eight 
I can upgrade this axe <laughs> three times. I would have needed money because I haven't really done a lot of trading, so I don't have that much money. Uh, and he would get very strong. I think this is 12 strength. Let's look at casual. Yeah, he would probably be up at 28 strength as well. Uh, Titan also engages, so people can disengage, right? And this was not my plan, but we got this new sword. This sword is mental. This sword is way too good. Yeah, I'm just gonna go out and say that. This sword is too good. Uh, let's look at the actual skill here. Uh, you do yield 80% of strength all around you, which is pretty good. But you're also going to do a pushback by two meters on everyone. That's a super cool ability. Works really well with the barrage here. Uh, but the big thing is, if they can't be knocked back, you do 150% extra damage. And this is another weapon that's level 6. So I can upgrade this. And he's going to be pretty insane. He's also going to reach level 8 soon, so I can upgrade it twice. Uh, we got some new skills. Duelist. I like Final Blow. Nothing game altering. Um, if he's engaged, he gets brutality. I think that's fair. It's shitty for Victator here. I just took it because it was a new one. But of course, Victator here, uh, this is just shit. I should not have taken that because he's also never engaged. Uh, Daring would have been better. Only that he kills things. If he engages, no. If he engages, no. Like. There's three skills about engaging here. So the only viable option for like a two-handed swordsman is the weakening skill. Because I have that uh, so many other guys engaging, right? Um, yeah. I'm gonna get disarm on another dude here. We have not been able we haven't gotten to level 10, so we have, like, new freaking skills down here that we haven't tried out. Uh, they're different, right? Yeah. Second weapon is the same for everyone. So you can have two bows and swap between them. I like this. I think that's fun. And we got some new... Have a chance to not become engaged. I don't necessarily think this is good for the archer. Lone Wolf. Mm. Damage increased by 10% if there's no one within 5 meters. Well, um, I would rather just stand next to my Brutality guy. He gives Brutality too, so... Yeah, unless I have Brutality some other way, this is much better to put my Archer next to it. But yeah, we're also like, I have this arm on him. I never use it. Don't need to. I got, yeah, we got Thrill of the Hunt with Rage. You saw that in the last battle. He's got like 100% more damage at the end there. Insane. And all of these skills we got after we got everything under control. What did he get? Rivalry. Doesn't really get hit though, so it doesn't really matter. They have to do something with the difficulty so that... Because when I reach level 5, the skills are huge to get. So important to get the skills here. Because we're often struggling, we're trying to get uh, uh, different uh, attacks. No, uh, new weapons, new armor and everything. At level 4, 5. Then after 5, we're starting to get control on things. Six, seven. At that point, I pretty much kill everything with no issue whatsoever. 
Now, that is because I've kind of thought about what I'm doing with my team. I think that's a big play there. I started out with like, okay, if we can go close and have some armored people, we can engage, we can use smoke screen. If I have a, if I'm gonna be up close, I can have someone in the back just doing barrage. So that works well together. And we took uh, protection on him, gave him a shield, so we got uh, deflection. So casual Viking only takes normally one damage from the attacks, right? The same with space hair. This is also a new weapon, by the way. I like this weapon. Nothing insane, but it means that for Space Air, if he engages with this one, he gets deflection from this, and then he attacks with this, and then he's already engaged, so he gets protection. That means he takes one damage from the next hit. Nice and easy. That works well. Uh, oh, we have one new thing we also looked at. Uh, yeah. We got Barbarian. New class. Deals damage to the target. Double damage if the target's health is higher. Mm, that's probably gonna. That's gonna be the case in a lot of fight. Case in uh, most fights, I think. If you're playing on hard, most people are gonna have more health than you. I think this is a nice skill. Of course, this is insane when you upgrade it. It's only repost at the beginning, but when you get the upgrade, you also get inspiration on people not engaged. Uh, this is a cool skill. You can deal some damage. Uh, and he does 35% more damage on people with full health. That means people with armor. So... I might like this more than, for example, Fury. You can get Fury in other ways. Yeah, I think First Blood is really good. Here we got this. Never used that. Should have taken this. Battle Cry, Brutality for everyone around him. I mean, Sentinel. I think Sentinel should take Battle Cry most of the time. Then he's a good buffer, right? But yeah. I think that's the end of this run. So if you've uh, been watching to see... Uh, some more tales i'm sorry but hello jens <laughs> welcome in we are just finishing up with war tales today i can respec him yes so you can do that um, over here at the brotherhood training grounds i think it costs like 500 though so it's quite expensive uh i just played for like an hour here jens and um I realize I'm just I'm just slaughtering everything we're fighting. So yeah, it gets they need to add they need to add something to make the game harder at higher levels. So we're gonna go over and play some Soulstone Survivors because I'm really enjoying that game at the moment. We started playing in that this weekend. Played some yesterday. And we're gonna play uh, like three hours of that today. But for War Tales, as soon as they add something for my enemies, we'll be playing more War Tales. I love this game. It just needs to get harder. Uh. That's uh, with that said, like I've played it for several hundred hours, so <laughs> that matters when it comes to the difficulty. I would much rather take an update only to make my enemy stronger than a new zone. Hopefully, we get like both at some point. But I don't, I don't know what the roadmap is right now. Anyways, we're gonna take a short break here. I'm gonna s I'll save this. 
and go to the menu. So I'll go get something to drink. We're gonna switch up the game here to Soulstone Survivors. <laughs> 